I thought it only fear. Just in case you do watch the movie. Three times it says lock up. 19. Oh, sorry. 2019. That's when it came out. Was that when we saw it? Me and Gary? Or Gary? Got the glory on his back. He recognises the feeling, the buzz of the glory. He missed out on fire. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? He heard the word of the Lord last Christmas on the DVD. Okay. So I finally watched half the corny movie. The romantic male three times tries to get the selfish bitch, she was me, to look up. I'm a selfish bitch. I'm modelled on that girl. All the one-liners basically sum up my life in that movie. I cried when my daughter sung. She sang the song that the girl did in the audition, my daughter, Amy. Very exiled. How did she get here when she's talking to her father? Through the tunnel. Through the fucking vagina. Through the portal. That's why you need to be born again. What did they see when they looked up? Things they don't normally see. Don't notice. A giant effing locust. And there's a picture of them. Through the locust circle the couple yeah and they're twin Jesuses little statues in the Christmas shop that she works in the Asian woman because you know it's the Chinese that come runs a shop and her name is Santa and they drop the end they drop the N. Go through it. Satan. Santa, Satan. <laughs> See, I'm even wearing red. Santa, Satan. Joy to the world. The Lord has come. And they're twins. And she goes, Jesus Christ. Just when... She's helping to decide with the lady which of the twins to buy. Which messiah? That one looks like it's having a lot more fun. I'm having a lot of fun. I'm having so much fun at your expense. Because we run rings around you. Brian Pine is ringing again. I'm not answering his telephone calls. Give them an inch, they take a mile. That's me, and it's him. Don't judge. They're scouts, all right. S A S S O S. It's this nation, I tell you. <laughs> There's nowhere that is not going to be a killing field. Big wave hitting Australia. Fire going up. But it's God's mercy. The fire is God's mercy. And I'm bringing it. It's God's glory. Can you stand in it? Did you know what you get when you stand in it? Because I stand in it. I hold fast in it. I dig in and dig deep in it. Do you know what you get? The glory. Which is the knowledge of God. The wisdom of Solomon. If Solomon screwed up. <laughs> Good and proper. So did I. So did everyone else in that church.
This is not a love song with Elijah. There's flash clips in that with Elijah. The one who went up in the chariot. So, she's in the taxi with her father. They're exiles from Yugoslavia. She's going on and being self-indulgent about her life and how miserable it is. And he goes, how did I get here? And he says, through the tunnel. Because I just went through a tunnel. That's how we got here. Last Christmas. It's a locust. Look up. It's two mice. Three blind mice. Three blind mice. See how they run. See how they run. To art and culture, isn't it? Well, the Lord's turning everything bucking up. If you have eyes to see, there's a horse in the secret garden in the middle of Britain somewhere. A horse. Two horses. Second horse has a dead sheep in it. I can do what cat can do. I'm an artist. I have eyes. I'm a carpenter. But I'm the ears. So did you see the movie? Did you see the movie? Anyway, I'm going to have a drink. Two thousand nineteen, it was released. I can't, I can't tell you with all the movie. The word come in two thousand nineteen, or whether it come in two thousand twenty. It came in Christmas two thousand twenty. The movie was released last Christmas in two thousand nineteen. I haven't even googled that. You don't normally buy a DVD until after a release date, so it was 2020. And the Lord said, prepare. And none of you have done. There is a storm coming. And none of you have any fucking idea, really. It's happening right under your nose, and it's two years ago that he wrapped this thing up. I've been walking in faith for two years. Hmm. You don't know what walking in faith is, do you? You think you started when you got saved. You got a down payment. You've got no idea what the Lord has for you when he pulls back the veil. You think he's just this or just that and you put him in a box. You've got no idea who he is. That's why you're not in love. You don't recognise him. That's why you're not in love. Why are some chosen? Why aren't some others chosen? And who is the harvest? And who are the harvesters? Well, you watch the last video there. The forbidden word, the gay preacher, the evangelist from Christ Church. He did more for the people of Christchurch after the earthquakes than any other pastor in that in Christchurch. That one. Well, you'll be forgotten for your good works. But you'll be remembered for your sin. And Jezebel sits in the church and purposely sits behind me and says, Oh, did you go to Elam Church as well? And I said, Yeah. What happened to Clinton, when I sort of knew, because I just throw out a fleece, right? She said, I don't know. And then I said, well, the Lord said, he's going to be a minister and a great minister back here in Christchurch. 
she says. He'll never lead again. I heard Satan. He'll never lead again. The ones he's tried to take out are the ones you should be watching. Because they're hidden. Hidden in Christ.